Hey everybody, I just wanted to take a minute to go over um, one thing that I think is kind of glossed over in terms of helping students out um, if there's confusion. And so this is the mind map that everybody gets at the beginning of a unit. Okay, this is the unit one mind map. And so there's all the all of these links, anything that's underlined is a link and then the WSQ is the assignment. So students can go through this more quickly if they know that they're a busy week. Um, but that's not what this um, screencast is about. What I want to do is I want to draw your attention to this, um, this link right up here in this corner. Every link or every mind map um, is going to have this and this is what I'm calling supplemental materials and I'll click on it and when you open it up you can see what's going on okay now if your student or if you are a student are having issues first of all you can see my lesson plans these are what I turn into my supervisor you can see the online book um, and I give directions click it and download it if you open it up um, actually, it's too big to actually be opened by um, a Chromebook, but if you download it, you can open it. And then for students who are struggling, let's say they don't understand scientific notation or you don't understand scientific notation, there's a video, a different video, there's a worksheet on how to write scientific notation, there's a video on how to use your TI-83 for this class, um, a supplemental or more more videos on this and so this is kind of like a living document this document gets updated as we go through and we want to um, put things in okay and, or take things out sometimes some things don't work at all um, and so this is a way you can see that some of these there's worksheets with answers and then there's more videos there's things from there's a textbook the class has a textbook um, that people can borrow or use or sign out or take um, and then the online textbook there's online textbook problems so you can see that it's not complete but it's not complete kind of on purpose because as students have issues we want to refer them to there so um, this is like what to do on your own if a, if your student or you are struggling with the um, with the content so I hope that clarifies what that's for and have a great day